Ronaldo's transfer discussed in Barcelona, Mane gets closer to Bayern, while Lewandowski gets further and further away from Munich. Liverpool and Man United are battling for Darwin, and Barca have already figured out with which star they have to replace the young. Let's get the show on the pitch! Barca are interested in Carlos Soler, and Nico could enter the operation. PSG have started talks with Inter over the transfer of Milan's Cunier. Valencia have announced the appointment of Gennaro Gattuso as their newly minted head coach. Bakayosaka was named Arsenal's player of the season for the second time in a row. He is the team's top scorer, having 12 goals. He has shown it. He is very mature. He is building his career and his commitment with a lot of sense of responsibility. Emmanuel Macron praised Kylian Mbappe. Tottenham wanted to sign Rashford, but Manchester United rejected their bid. Marcus has a desire to impress Ten Hag. Newcastle have bought defender Matt Target from Aston Villa for 15 million pounds. Barcelona have sold striker Ferran Hudgla to Club Brugge for 5 million euros. Carlo Ancelotti sees Jesus as an alternative to Kylian Mbappe. The manager of Real Madrid spoke with Man City forward over a possible move. It's unlikely that anyone will be able to replace Ronaldo, not only in Portugal but in the world, Fernando Santos claimed. Blatter and Platini's trial over alleged corrupt payments began in Switzerland. They face up to five years in prison. I'm really happy that Neymar said that I should win the Ballon d'Or, but in my opinion Karim Benzema deserves it more. Vinicius Jr. is quoted by Eurosport. Real Madrid have extended Luka Modric's contract until 2023. They have offered bail to us. I've spoken with his agent, shared Hetafe president on Hel Torres. Braithwaite wants to quit Barca for free by terminating his contract. The club intends to receive 5 million euros for Martin. Liverpool are willing to sell Takumi Minamino for 20 million euros. Monaco, Wolverhampton, Southampton, Leeds and Fulham are looking for the player's services. Messi is undisputed for Argentina. The rest of us have to show that we are at the level of the national team. Leo is unique. Leandro Paredes stated. Chelsea have announced the departure of Saul Niguez. The midfielder loaned from Atletico is going to return to the Indians. Chelsea are set to let Lukaku go to Inter. The parties will have to agree on the loan's worth. Juventus are not convinced that Angel Di Maria should be purchased. Now Domenico Berardi is the main attack option, while Kostic and Mudrik are alternatives. Barca see Gerard Moreno as an alternative to Lewandowski. Villarreal are to require about 40 million euros. I had several opportunities to join Madrid. In one, I was in the World Cup, the other three when I was younger, Ferran Torres told. Man City have not yet introduced Erling Haaland as he wants to wear number 9. It won't be taken from Gabriel Jesus while he's still on the roster. Dries Mertens was offered to Roma, as Napoli have rejected the player's salary demands. Barca are monitoring Shakhtar Donetsk right back Dodo. The Catalans believe that he has what it takes to become the new Dani Alves. Porto intend to buy Clement Langley, Gerard Romero reports. I knew where I was coming from that the club was going through a difficult time and that we had to do our best to qualify for the Champions League. Now we have to think about the following season and try to win titles," Ferran Torres stated. Pirlo is close to being appointed to the Turkish Fatih Karagumruk. The contract is valid for two years. Zlatan Ibrahimovic will become an ambassador for the Swedish Football Association at the end of his career. Tuchel is promised to have control on Chelsea transfers like Pep at Man City and Klopp at Liverpool. The new owners see the coach as the club's most important asset. Renato Sanchez is close to joining AC Milan for 18 to 20 million euros. Chelsea are interested in 30-year-old Inter defender Stefan de Vrij. After a year, he can leave for free. Napoli are set to give Federico Bernardeschi 2.5 million euros a year. Former Juventus winger wants 3 million. Manchester United joined the race for Alessandro Bastoni. Man City and Tottenham Hotspur are also eyeing Inter defender. Chelsea's targets in attack are Sterling and Nkuku, not Dembele. Boyle is ready to arrange De Ligt's transfer. More Nation League fixtures took place yesterday. The results are in front of you. Moving on to the main topics of the release. Let's have a brief rewind of yesterday's fixtures. 
In League A of the Nations League, Belgium, after a humiliating defeat from the Netherlands, decided to take revenge on Poland instead. 6-1. Trossard made it to a brace, Witzel, De Bruyne, Den Donker, and Appenda scored one each, while Lewandowski scored for the Eagles. The Netherlands, in turn, withstanded Wales 1-2. Coupe Mainers and Wachhorst secured victory for Van Gaal's team. In Group B, Ukraine beat Ireland thanks to Tsigankov's accurate shot, while Scotland defeated Armenia with 2-0. Ainshur made the first contract bid on Paula Dybala. Yesterday, the first official meeting between the representatives of the Nerazzurri and, and the agent of the former Juve representative took place. Ainshur offered the Argentine a four-year deal with a salary of 6 million euros per year as well as bonuses, according to the website of journalist Gianluca Di Marzio. Nevertheless, Dybala asks for a higher salary, 8 million euros per year, and bonuses. In general, negotiations were going positively. The parties are about to meet again in a few days. Two biggest clubs in England are competing for Darwin Nunez. Liverpool are preparing a verbal offer for the Benfica attacker worth 80 million euros plus bonuses, according to insider Fabrizio Romano. Besides, representatives of Manchester United also contacted the Uruguayan's agents. Both the Reds and the Red Devils do not intend to compete in terms of who will lay out more for a 22-year-old footballer. Nunez scored 34 goals and delivered 4 assists in 41 appearances for Benfica in all competitions throughout last campaign. Manchester United are working hard on Frankie de Jong's transfer. The Red Devils head coach Eric Ten Hag talked to Barca midfielder. The manager from the Netherlands convinces his compatriot to go to Manchester United and promises Frankie that the tactics are to be built around him. United are offering 60 million euros for the 25-year-old and another 20 million in bonuses, according to Marca. Barca are open to get rid of the midfielder in order to reduce salary cap and afford transfers of newcomers. As we mentioned, Barcelona are ready to sell Frankie to Manchester United to offload the payroll and focus on transfers. The club no longer considers the young one of the leaders of the team. The management of Xavi really wants to see Manchester City midfielder Bernardo Silva in the squad. In the event of the young leaving Blaugrana camp, Barca will attempt to sign Bernardo, as the Portuguese wants to find himself at camp now. Liverpool have lowered requests for the price tag of their star winger Sadio Mane. Earlier on, it became known that Liverpool rejected the second offer of Bayern for the Senegalese. The Munich side proposed about 35 million euros. Despite their refusal, the parties' stocks are finding more common ground, and the negotiations are becoming more clear. In particular, the Reds, who initially asked for 50 million euros, now agree to 45 million. Build rates. Money himself also wants to move to Bayern, and he has asked Liverpool for that. The Reds' boss Jurgen Klopp already agreed to the departure of the 30-year-old. Robert Lewandowski answered a question about his new club. If I have few suitors, it's because I only consider one option, noted the Bavarian Zeiss. We recall that the 33-year-old striker's intention was to join the ranks of Barcelona. Yesterday in Barcelona, a meeting between Jorge Mendes and the leadership of Barcelona was arranged. Football fans, having seen this news, immediately began to write about the possible move of Ronaldo, since Mendes is known to be his agent. But in fact, the following names were discussed – Nico, Lengley, Trincao, Di Maria, Soler, and Guedes. Barca Socios – which Mendes' clients would you prefer to see in the club? Friends, watch the new video from our Inside Football project and find out what ban Cristiano Ronaldo imposed on his mother. It was Football News. Have a nice one and see you in a bit!